book of Revelation chapter 12 verse 11, listen carefully. And they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb, and by the word of their testimony. And they loved not their lives unto the death. Close your eyes. Place your, your right hand upon your chest. And take this confession. Say, blood of Jesus, wash me. Blood of Jesus, saturate me. Blood of Jesus, cleanse me. Blood of Jesus, redeem my soul from troubles. Blood of Jesus, show me the way. Blood of Jesus, wash me. Blood of Jesus, saturate me. Blood of Jesus, cleanse me. Blood of Jesus, redeem my soul from troubles. Blood of Jesus, show me the way. Blood of Jesus, wash me. Blood of Jesus, saturate me. Blood of Jesus, cleanse me. Blood of Jesus, redeem my soul from troubles. Blood of Jesus, show me the way. May the blood of Jesus show you the way in Jesus' name. By the grace of God, the Lord minister two hymns into my spirit while writing this script. Two hymns. I want you to close your eyes. Take this hymn from the bottom of your heart. There is power, power, wonder working power in the blood of the Lamb. There is power, power, wonder working power in the precious blood of the Lamb. Hymn number two. There is power mighty in the blood. There is power mighty in the blood. There is power mighty in the blood of Jesus Christ. There is power mighty in the blood. Brethren across the world, the blood of Jesus is very powerful. The blood of Jesus is potent. The blood of Jesus is a wonder-working power. Have you used the, the name of Jesus Christ and it has failed you? Have you used Holy Ghost to challenge that situation? It has failed you. And have you used the blood of Jesus Christ? It has failed you. Now, you need to use that blood of Jesus again. Apply the blood of Jesus concerning that situation. Because if there's anything the enemy is afraid of, it is the blood of Jesus. The blood, the blood of Jesus Christ will cleanse away your sins today. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. There's indeed power in the blood of Jesus. The power in the blood of Jesus Christ has provided everything we need to live a life of victory, healing, protection, redemption, and authority over the power of the devil. Pleading the blood of Jesus Christ through prayers have been considered as the most effective weapon of destroying the works of the enemy, as taken from the book of Revelation chapter 12, verse 11. In Hebrews 12, verse 24, the Bible says, The blood of Jesus Christ speaks a better thing than the, the blood of Abel. The blood of Jesus Christ can never be infected. The blood of Jesus Christ can never go weak. The more you plead the blood of Jesus Christ against any situation, the closer your victory. Applying the blood of Jesus Christ upon your body, applying the blood of Jesus Christ upon the soul of your business, applying the blood of Jesus Christ up, upon the foundation of your house can stand as an edge of protection. In the spirit realm, blood is a medium of exchange. For example, Cain killed his brother out of envy. We are told that the blood of Abel cried out against Cain's virtues in the ground. When you see blood flowing from somewhere, how would you feel? I am sure you will feel shocked. So many Christians don't bother pleading or calling on the name of Jesus Christ during that battle because they feel it has no effect on them. One of the important, one of the important of the blood of Jesus Christ is, is the establishment is the establishment and the power of redeeming our sins and to enhance us our to enhance our deliverance the bible says we are justified by the blood of jesus as taken from the book of romans chapter 5 verse 8 to 11. there are great testimonies from people who believe on the power of applying the blood of jesus against any form of affliction if the devil is using human 
or animal blood as a form of covenant of evil exchange of your virtues, then you must use the blood of Jesus Christ to retrieve your glory from them. If you are sick, you need to plead the blood of Jesus Christ. If you are afraid of attack, you need to plead the blood of Jesus Christ upon your life. If you are planning to travel by road or hair by, or by water, the blood of Jesus Christ should be used constantly to attach or to subdue and scatter all the evil plans against you. Behold, the evil plans against you will be scattered in Jesus' name. If you suddenly see birds flying over your head, you need to bring down, you need to bring down that evil bird by the power in the blood of Jesus. If you stand in front of your house and play the blood of Jesus every day, you will find out that the power of darkness in that environment will disappear. Many Christians are being robbed, cheated, raped, afraid. By pleading the blood of Jesus Christ, we immune you against any form of sickness. The blood of Jesus, if applied very well, it can remove your burdens and the bondage of the wicked upon your life. Do you know, if you keep applying the blood of Jesus Christ upon you and your family, no evil will come near your dwelling. The blood cannot work. The blood of Jesus cannot work if you are a sinner. But be, be born again. You must be pure and live a holy life. You must be baptized by the blood of Jesus Christ. I pray in the name of Jesus, the power, wonder-working power in the blood of Jesus Christ shall work for you in the name of Jesus Christ. And this power in the blood of Jesus Christ can never, never work if you are still dwelling in sin. If your hand is still doing evil, it can never work. You will just be decreeing, decreeing the blood of Jesus. By the power in the blood of Jesus, let my enemy scatter. Your enemy will not scatter. Why? Because there's a sin inside of you that is making that blood of Jesus Christ of no effect in your life. I pray after this prayer session, the blood of Jesus Christ will deliver you and save you and redeem you from the hands of your enemies in Jesus' name. By the grace of God, we are having three prayer sections. And the instruction behind this prayer sections, all the three prayer sessions is to embark on 12 days fasting and prayers between 6 a.m. and 6 p.m. Take a bottle of water or any water for prayer. Then, while bringing out that water, read the following Bible verse into that water. Revelation chapter 12 verse 11, Ex Exodus chapter 12 verse 13, and Hebrews chapter 12 verse 24. So in all the sessions, we are having confession and praise and worship for five minutes. Section 1, the Confession Bible verse is taken from the book of Psalm 138, verse 7, supported by praise and worship for five minutes. Close your eyes, bring out your water. At all the sections of these prayers, you are going to use that water, you drink that water, and you apply that water in every corner of your house. So, that water, it can be a table water, any clean water you can drink, you can apply, you can sprinkle around your house, the soul of your business. If your business is not moving forward, Apply this water as the blood of Jesus Christ. Is your child, are, are your children sick? Apply this water as the, as, as the blood of Jesus. Are you not making progress? Apply the blood of Jesus Christ upon your life and it shall work for you. Throughout the three sections of this prayer point, we'll be praying on this water. Prayer point number one. Pray this prayer point for three minutes. Say, let the blood of Jesus wash away my sin and save me from troubles. In the name of Jesus, let the blood of Jesus wash away my sin and save me from trouble. Take this prayer point for five minutes. Let the blood of Jesus wash away my sin and save me from troubles. Save me from troubles. Save me from troubles. Save me from troubles. Me from troubles. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number two. Take this prayer point for five minutes. Say, let the blood of Jesus fight against any evil sacrifice carried out against me. In the name of Jesus, let the blood of Jesus fight against any evil sacrifice carried out against me. In the name of Jesus, let the blood of Jesus fight against any evil sacrifice carried against me. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number three. I want you to lay your right hand upon your head and take this prayer point. Say, let the blood of the lamb retrieve my glory from the body of any sacrificial animal. In the name of Jesus, let the blood of the lamb retrieve my glory from the body of any sacrificial animal. In the name of Jesus, let the blood of Jesus take this prayer point for five minutes. Let the blood of the lamb retrieve my glory from the body of any sacrificial animal. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number four. 
Take this prayer point for five minutes. Say, let the blood of Jesus arise and defend me in the war front. In the name of Jesus, let the blood of Jesus arise and defend me in the war front. In the name of Jesus, let the blood of Jesus arise and defend me in the war front. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number five. Take this prayer point for five minutes. Say, let the blood, in, let the power in the blood of Jesus silence and weaken any evil altars working against my promotion, my breakthrough, and my deliverance. In the name of Jesus, let the power in the blood of Jesus silence and weaken any altars, any evil altars working against my promotion, breakthrough, and deliverance. In the name of Jesus, take this prayer point for five minutes. Let the power in the blood of Jesus silence and weaken any evil altars working against my promotion, my breakthrough, my deliverance. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Take this last prayer point, prayer point number six, loud and clear. Place your right hand upon that water. Take it loud and clear. Say, let the efficacy in the wonder-working power of the blood of Jesus dismantle any ancient problems, tying, tying down my virtues, tying the virtues, tying the virtues of my family. In the name of Jesus, let the efficacy in the wonder-working power of the blood of Jesus dismantle any ancient problem. Tying down my virtues in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So take that water now. Bring out that water. Begin to drink that water now. Say, I drink the blood of Jesus. Just a little water. Say, I drink the blood of Jesus. Take that water now. Apply it on your forehead. If you have children around you, apply it on the forehead of your children. Take this water, sprinkle it around your room right now. The Lord is taking control. That spirit of fear is gone. That sickness is gone. That kidney problem is gone. That fibro in the womb is gone. In Jesus' name. Section 2. Prayer section 2. Our confession Bible verse is taken from the book of Psalm 25 verse 1 to 2. Praise and worship for 5 minutes. So let your water still remain in this section 2. You are still going to pray. You are still going to repeat what we did in section 1. Prayer point number one. Take this prayer point for five minutes. Say, I plead the blood of Jesus upon my name and my children's name in the name of Jesus. I plead the blood of Jesus upon my name and my children's name. If you don't have children, don't worry. Mention them. Say, I plead the blood of Jesus upon my name and my children's name in the name of Jesus. Take this prayer point for five minutes. Until you are sweat, you are not praying. Say, I plead the blood of Jesus upon my name and my children's name in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number two. Prayer point number two, place your right hand upon the wall of your house. Place your right hand upon the wall of your house and take this prayer point for five minutes. Say, I plead the blood of Jesus over my house and its environment in the name of Jesus. Pray this prayer point for five minutes. Say, I plead the blood of Jesus over my house and its environment in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number three. Prayer point number three, bring out your money. Any money you have with you, any money you have with you right now, any money you have with you in your position, in your bag, in your wallet, or in your on, or in anywhere, any money you have, don't bring it out now. Take this prayer upon line and clear and place your right hand upon that money. Say, I I apply the blood of Jesus over my bank account in the name of Jesus. I apply the blood of Jesus over my bank account in the name of Jesus. I apply the blood of Jesus upon my bank account, upon my bank account in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Man, I want you to place your right hand upon your head. Place your right hand upon your hand. Place your right hand upon your left hand. And place your left hand, your left hand upon your right hand. You don't understand. Your right hand, place it here. And pray this prayer. And your left hand, place it here. And take this prayer. And you are going to apply the blood of Jesus Christ upon your head, upon your hand, and upon your leg. Take this prayer point for five minutes with demonstration in the spirit. Say, I apply the blood of Jesus upon my head, upon my hands, upon my legs for divine guidance and protection and favor. In the name of Jesus, I apply the blood of Jesus upon my head, upon my hands, upon my legs for divine guidance, protection and favor. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number five. I want to take this prayer point for three minutes. Say, I stand upon the word of God in Psalm 118 verse 17 against any form of untimely death in my life in the name of Jesus. I stand upon the word of God in Psalm 118 verse 17 against any form of untimely death in my life and, in, and my family in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray.
Amen. Prayer point number six. Take this prayer point loud and clear. Take this last prayer point loud and clear. Place your right hand upon your head. Say, I soak my glory, my destiny, my star in the blood of Jesus. I soak my glory, my destiny, my star in the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Bring out that water. Begin to pour that water on your head. I see somebody is pouring water on your head. Yes, bring out that water. Begin to pour as if you are bathing. And begin as you are doing that, say, I soak my glory. As you are pouring that water on your head, say, I soak my glory. I soak my destiny. I soak my star in the blood of Jesus Christ. Do this for 20 minutes, please. Do this for 20 minutes. May the Lord give us wisdom in Jesus' name. Prayer section 3, which is the last session for this prayer for praying the blood of Jesus. Our confession Bible verse is taken from the book of Isaiah chapter 49 verse 24 to 26. The Bible says, Shall the prey be taken from the mighty or the lawful captive delivered? 25. But thus says the Lord, even the captives of the mighty shall be taken away and the prey of the terrible shall be delivered. For I will contend with him that contended with thee. I will save thy children. 26. I will feed them that oppress thee with their own flesh and they shall be drunken with their own blood. As we swine and all flesh shall know that I the Lord and thy Savior and thy Redeemer, the mighty one of Jacob. Please support this Bible verse with praise and worship for five minutes. So you are still going, you are still going to pray on that water. Are still going to pray on that water. Bring out that water. Take that, raise that water up to the heavens. Take this prayer point number one, loud and clear, for four minutes. Say, blood of Jesus, speak against all witchcraft verdicts leveled against me in the name of Jesus. Blood of Jesus, speak against all witchcraft verdicts leveled against me. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number two. I want to take this prayer point for five minutes. Say, I apply the blood of Jesus against any stubborn battle in my life and remove whatever my father has not planted in the name of Jesus. Say, I apply the blood of Jesus against any stubborn battles in my life and remove whatever my father has not planted in the name of Jesus. Say, I apply the blood of Jesus against any stubborn battles in my life and remove whatever my father has not planted in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number three. I want you to take this prayer point for five minutes. Say, as I drink the blood of Jesus, let every deadly disease in my body expire in the name of Jesus. As I drink the blood of Jesus, let every deadly disease in my body expire. What do you want God? What do you want to be expired in your life, in your destiny? Begin to use that blood of Jesus. Have you, uh, have you been eating in the dream? Begin to use that blood of Jesus to neutralize every evil effect of that dream. Say, as I drink the blood of Jesus, pray it for five minutes. Let every deadly disease in my body die. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number four. We will repeat again. Say, as I drink the blood of Jesus, take it for five minutes. As I drink the blood of Jesus, let every object moving in my body cease in the name of Jesus. As I drink the blood of Jesus, let every object moving in my body cease in the name of Jesus. Cease in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number five. Take this prayer point for three minutes. Say, any strange child crying in the ground, in the hair, or from the water against me. Blood of Jesus, silence them forever. In the name of Jesus, any strange child crying in the ground, in the air, or from the water against me. Blood of Jesus, silence them forever. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I want you to place, I want you to hold I want you to hold your hair, your hair, as you are taking these prayers. Hold your hair like this. Hold it like this and decree this prayer point. Say, any of my glory, any of my glory taken away from me through laying on of hands. Say, any of my glory that has, that has been taken away from me through laying of hands, blood of Jesus, Restore it back to its original state in the name of Jesus. Take this prayer point of five minutes. Any of my glory that have been taken away from me through laying of hands, blood of Jesus, restore it back to me. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So taking the blood of Jesus prayers, the Lord will arise and help you and redeem you. And the mercy of God will show up in the name of Jesus Christ. 
So take that water, begin to drink that water. Drink that water, sprinkle that water around. That water, there's power in the blood of Jesus. There's power in that water. The power of God is in that water. Use it to bath, sprinkle it around your house. If you have business, sprinkle it around the soul of your business, around your house environment, anywhere you want to use as a point of contact. If you feel that you are, you are being monitored, place it around your body and the Lord will take control in Jesus' name. Kindly use this opportunity to, to share this broadcast to somebody because these prayers might be of help to them. Once again, this is Evangelist Joshua from Lagos. Mm -hmm.